Hi, this is Nathan, your neighborhood arcade and pinball talk guy. I'm actually at the Sinking Ship in Indianapolis, Indiana, reviewing Transformers Autobots by Stern Pinball today. Please look for a review underneath the description of our YouTube video, as well as like and follow us on Arcade and Pinball Talk Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, as well as click that YouTube subscribe button. If you like arcade, if you like pinball, click subscribe now. Join our family. Let's go ahead and get this review underway, shall we? First thing first, this uh, table is very, very dark. Could use a set of pin stadiums. But uh, all in all, it looks pretty good. It looks a lot of clip art to the middle of the play field, so it looks pretty nice. First impressions are good at Transformers, for God's sake. Can't really go wrong with Transformers. Art looks really good. Package for the back, back glass and translight looks good. It's what you would expect from a Transformers game. The toys, Optimus Prime, everything kind of in the middle. They got some toys on this. It looks really, really nice. Sound bite so far good. I do love the fact that the ramps actually light up the color of the Decepticon or the Autobot. So Decepticon ramp turns purple. Optimus Prime, as far as the Autobots ramp, turns red. Pretty cool, I like that. The coloration is really cool. Sound bites are also really nice. And the music is very complimentary as well. So our package is there, theme is there, it's Transformers. Um, Right off the bat, I mean, table mechanics on this thing, God, there's so much going on on this thing. I mean, where do you start? Flipper gap's not too bad. You got your in lane to the left, right, out lane to the left, right. Got a kick out to the left going around there. I'll try to stop this ball real quick. You have a ramp, uh, you have a lane that goes up to some pop levers, some columns to the left. You have a ramp that's a Decepticon ramp that goes around, comes back to your left, have a trail to your left in lane. You have a challenged Megatron, which is the gun. So you go through the middle, Saves the ball, locks it, then shoots it out the middle at you towards your flippers. You got a lane going up to Optimus Prime back there as well. That's kind of a mini orbit. Uh, you have a captured, captive ball to the right of that, a uh, Autobot ramp going up, and it kind of moves around back there and comes back to your right habit trail, your end lane. Uh, there goes your uh, lane with the spinner going around to your uh, columns, uh, as well as some targets to say skids and mud flap on there. All your modes are to the middle, of course, Bumblebee, Starscream, Megatron, Optimus Prime, so forth. So that's the whole point. Hit the ramps, light it up, hit your modes. Beautiful table, though. Soundtrack seems to be complimentary at this point. There goes that little loopy mini orbit there. Flipper gap's not too bad on that. But anyway, yeah, replayability on this, I'd say it's there. I mean, Transformers is definitely a fun machine. Plays well, sounds good, artwork is there. Uh, you know, it's flip art, of course, but you know, other than that, it looks pretty good. Trying to hit that Bumblebee car up there. Cap, cap the ball as many times as I can. So Optimus, two more hits, starts off multi-ball. So yeah, replayability is there. Fun factor, I do like this game. I mean, the artwork could have been a little bit different on it, but I think it's actually fitting for what it is. So all in all, great table. Check out our review. All the metrics are gonna be written out underneath the description of the video. Click show more and or click the headline on mobile. It'll drop down, you can read it there. Uh, again, thank you for watching. Please click subscribe. Until next time.